The trooper attempted to stop this vehicle, which was, was traveling in a very erratic manner. State police say a trooper was pursuing this pickup truck when it left 293 in Manchester, crashing into some trees, bursting into flames. Four hours after the crash, a wrecker pulled the charred and mangled pickup from the trees, the crash killing the driver, who was the only one in the pickup. State police say this was actually the second accident of the morning for the driver. In the area of exit two in Salem, it was reported uh, at one vehicle at, at sideswipe two other vehicles. State police say the driver apparently got out to talk, then took off northbound on 93. I saw a pickup truck swerving back and forth across the highway. Had his flashes on, uh, nearly crashed uh, several times. O'Laughlin says he saw the trooper try to stop the pickup. When the driver noticed the, the uh, officer chasing after him, he did increase his rate of speed. And it wasn't long, O'Laughlin says, before both vehicles disappeared from sight, only to have the chase come to an end a few miles up the road. The troopers uh, took immediate action uh, in, in removing uh, the operator from the immediate area, uh, pulling him uh, up the embankment and administering uh, first aid. Again, the driver didn't make it. It took firefighters about 20 minutes to put out the fire. Firefighters contending not only with the fire, but also with some angry hornets. It seems the pickup had come to rest on or near several nests, and a few firefighters were stung. Now, no troopers were injured in the incident, and there were no injuries in that initial crash down in Salem. One firefighter was transported from the scene on an unrelated illness. That firefighter was treated and released. Reporting live in Bedford, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.